<coughs> right, this is what I'm uh, doing now. This is the exhaust valve guide. Um, I'm doing this piece here, which is 500 by 250. Ignore these measurements, they're, they're not correct. Um, so it's a 250 by half inch. Um, I've measured the spring. Um, so anyway, also this side the measurements have changed because when I drilled the holes, um, where are we, these ones, I sort of cocked up a little bit on the measurements. Um, uh, there's a reason for that. No, anyway, um, so that, that's what we've got in the uh, jaws at the moment. And uh, we'll crack on, do this piece here, which is half an inch, plus one thirty second. Um, so that's uh, 500 and 0 .0 something or other, 031 I think, 0 .031. And that also needs to be 500 across here, at, at the uh, extremity of the uh, 031 measurement. Right, I've set the DRO now. I've zeroed the DRO as I've now faced this end off. I've set the DRO to zero, so if I now come down 0,531, I'll go down 0,500 first, and then I'll add the 31 on once I uh, get near the dimension. That's uh, 504. <coughs> 5015 500. Yeah, that's near enough. That's near enough for me. Um, Right, and now I need to reduce this bit down to a quarter. So, if I reset the dial, I want 250 off, so two times around and measure. Two fifty four. Two fifty four. Find the spring. Right, that measurement is uh, only really relevant to this uh, spring, so. The spring goes on. Yeah, that's fine. Perfect. 250. Right, I've also got to punch a, a 1 8 hole through there, but I'm going to do it from the other way. So we're going to take this out now, turn it over, put it back in, and do the detail on the other side. I only need a quarter of that left in and I've got well over half an inch there so what I'm going to do is just cut a bit off with a hacksaw otherwise I've got to machine all of that down which is pretty pointless I'll keep that really know what for but you never know right let's get that tidied up got about 300 there at the moment
not much to measure really, but um, I'm saying 300, so I'll come down. I'll come down 50 and call it 250. That's good enough. Right, that should be 250. Well, it says 251, but uh, that's near enough. Uh, where are we? Quarter. Mm, looks about right. <coughs> so, I need to reduce that dimension. Here's where we're going for. We're going for this one across there, 380. The reason it's 380 is because I made a bit of a cock up of these holes. I can't remember what I did wrong, but I did. And this hole is 375, so I'm going to bring it down to 380, try it, and then um, hopefully uh, get it to fit where it should go. Go down 125 now, down to 250. This is where we're at. Done that one. Got to come down another out 125 down to 250. So that's uh, 130 off of what we've got there. Should be 250. Well, 252 is good enough. Right, I'm going to drill a, a 764th hole through there um, and then ream out to 1 8th. Right, I'm going to ream to one eighth now for the valve. That's the uh, inlet valve. Which fits in here. Sorry, that's the exhaust valve, not the inlet valve. <coughs> Let's get the uh, um, the uh, exhaust valve, I'll put that in with a bit of a bit of Loctite. Should just be able to see it in there. Let's get the torch. Just about see that in there. Uh, 
Right, that's that done. That's all folks, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit the like button. I would also appreciate it if you would click the subscribe button because that will uh, enable me to grow the channel so that I can keep making these videos. Please leave a comment or a question. I do read all of the comments and reply to as many as I can. Thanks for watching.